Well, the investigation of still ongoing. Nevada lawmakers are kicking around the idea of a state service tax, but not everybody is thrilled with that proposal. Today, one Valley mayor is speaking out against the idea. North Las, Ve North Las Vegas Mayor Michael Montandon says a service tax unfairly targets certain business owners. News 3's Colette Wheeland is live for us this noon. And Colette, the mayor heard from people who would be directly affected by the tax today. I want to kind of explain exactly what a service tax is. Right now, if we have sales tax, you go into a retail store and you pay tax on that. But what about when you go see a lawyer or an accountant or even your hairdresser, like this salon behind us here? Well, you don't pay a tax and it's other independent professionals who provide a service for a fee. That's what we're talking about. So you don't pay a tax for those. But North Las Vegas Mayor Mike Montandon says that kind of tax is not going to be fair to everyone because he believes that it punishes entrepreneurs. He described the tax as a hidden personal income tax and that by taxing those services, you create another barrier for small business owners. The extra cost would also be passed on to consumers and the cost of a haircut would then likely go up. Mayor Montanin says if the state has to generate money, it should look at options that don't unfairly target one group of people. You will hear lots of arguments that a service tax is broad based and it affects everybody and that's not true. It does not affect those people who are not entrepreneurs, who aren't providing service to people. It, it, it really is not as fair as many of the other or, or a consumptive type tax. This is still obviously in the early stages. It's just a proposal. No one has even uh, voted on anything. It's like I said, it's very early, but the face does the state does face a multi-billion dollar budget deficit, so it's going to have to come up with some way to generate money, and this is just one of those ideas. Reporting live in Las Vegas, Colette Whelan, News 3. Yeah, we need a lot of ideas because our state is in a huge budget hole right now. Legislative leaders, in fact, holding a news conference at 1.30 this afternoon to talk about Nevada revenues and the potential impact. We'll have the latest details on later editions of News 3. Well, thousands of locals may